Powerful transistors and integrated microcircuits used in electronics such as high-capacity power supplies, voltage transformers and low-frequency amplifiers are always installed on heat sinks. Under difficult conditions, the bodies of such components may heat to almost critical temperatures. Thus, the possibility of a thermal or electric breakdown increases. These unwanted results may be prevented by controlling the radiator's temperature with the help of a sensor. The sensor must be placed directly on a heat sink. One of the variants of such a sensor is a heat sink or heat indicator using germanium transistors. A germanium transistor has unique amplification characteristics. Apart from that, it can react to temperature changes or heated surface. One of the parameters we sometimes have to pay attention to is a collector cutoff current. The current appears when the source is connected to a collector junction in the reverse direction. To make sure, we have to attach a measuring tester circuit in the ohmmeter node to outputs of the base and the collector of the transistor. The resistance of the reverse junction is high, thus the band switch must be adjusted to hundreds of ohms. Then we place the transistor's head on the heated object. In several seconds, the device's pointer will start indicating changes in the junction's resistance. In particular, it will show the resistance is falling. As the object cools down, the resistance of the transistor's junction will increase. Now we'd like to say a few words on the structure of the indicator. The device is made using point-to-point -point wiring to facilitate demonstration. The transistors are connected to supply circuit of the LED. They are installed on a radiator using a mica or heat conducting washer. The current running through the LED and transistor limits resistor R2. The input resistor and the stabilitron serve as a stabilizing circuit of the device. When the radiator heats up, a lot of LED will indicate the emergency situation, when the main device can't be further operated in the critical mode.